So for cases like this, where you have multiple machines and you want to see them all together, universal control comes in pretty handy where you want to use one mouse, one keyboard across all your devices on the same screen. <laughs> so here's how you do it. Um, right now I have these two already set up so that my mouse can just flow freely from one side, one computer, to another one like this. And that's going from this computer to this one. But what if I want to add another one? Well, if I just go and touch the edge, see, it's not going there. So what you need to do is go to display and then make sure that that computer is selected here. So I'm going to check that one. And then you can also go into display settings and make sure they're positioned correctly. So you can arrange them the way you want them. I've already prearranged them, but most likely they'll be all in a row. So I'm going to hit done here. And uh, this is another way you can add an extra machine right here. So now I can scroll down to the lower machine, theoretically. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> it's, there's a little bit of a delay, but it's not as much of a delay as if you're using a KVM. The problem is when your computer shuts down while you're in the middle of a demo. No, the computer didn't shut down. The monitor did. All right, back to it. The problem is that... When you have a fourth one, that does not work. So they only support up to three devices. Yep, that is uh, unfortunate. So if you have three, then you're good. If you have four, too bad. Apple says no.